Here you want Bernie Sanders to win in 2020. Bernie Sanders? You know what? When I'm taking my vacation, I'll have my feet up. I will not be involved in the American <laughs> elections. But you know what? You know who Bernie Sanders reminds me of? He reminds me just a little, little bit of <laughs> Uncle Joseph Stalin. <laughs> and I never thought that the American people would come around. But you know what? Joseph Stalin was a good communist. I'm not saying that Bernie Sanders is a communist. But it would be very nice to have somebody in America that reminds me of Uncle Joseph. <laughs> what do you think? And don't get me wrong. I am not involved in the American elections at all. No, no. I, <laughs> I like, have you ever met Donald Trump? No, I have not. I heard a rumor that you wanted Donald Trump on Beacon of Speech. That's correct. Well, let me tell you a story. I have met Donald Trump, and he is a fine, fine man. You know what? He smells very nice. I like to get up to him and smell. I am a red-blooded now, Russian man. I love women. Now, since we have you here, and you know Donald Trump, can you pull any strings? and? I, I will try, Ted Coley, but I, I want to be very clear. I love Russian women. <laughs> and you know what? Donald Trump loves Russian women, too. Wink, <laughs> wink, <laughs> not, not. Oh, oh, it's a very good week in Russia. If it's Uncle Joseph who's the, who's the president, that's great. <laughs> if it is Donald Trump, I like the way he speaks. I like the manliness of him. I like the way, in a, in a friend type of way, like we are chums and we could drink some vodka. Okay? I am straight as, an, as a matter of fact, right now, I am thinking of Russian women. Oh, I love, Ru you know who else likes women from Eastern Europe? Donald Trump. Donald Trump! <laughs> uh, you know what? Even though I love Russian women, I could go out with a Polish woman. Or a Hungarian woman. They are beautiful. The women in Eastern Europe are beautiful, mm -hmm. like in Russia. Not in Ukraine, <laughs> where they're ugly dogs. <laughs> but I'll tell you what. If it's Uncle Bernie, that is great. If it is Donald Trump, that is great also. Now, don't get me wrong. Me and Donald Trump, we don't see eye to eye on everything. And every once in a while, he throws me a curveball. But you know what? You have brothers, don't you, Ted? Yes, I do. You know, sometimes your brothers, they do things to anger you. Mm -hmm. But at the end of the day, you love your brother. Mm -hmm. Just like I love Donald. But we don't always see it eye to eye. And I had nothing to do with his election. <laughs> nothing. I was an innocent bystander. But if I took a vacation, I hung around in Minnesota, right? And I'm listening to the Rolling Stones, thinking about sympathy for the devil, I could see either one of those fine Americanos running the country, and I would be fine with either one of them.